really. I want to use some of the stone that we got, but I... Yeah, we use andesite. There we go. The reason for that is I do have to eventually just block that off so they just can't jump down there. Also, I'm going to remove the stair slash ramp. Pretty much all of this right here. And then right here. Nah, yeah, I'll leave that. That's fine. It's fine. It'll probably get removed here in a second anyway. So, it looks like we did get quite a lot accomplished in this set of episodes. And I will probably just continue this on with another one because we're already part way through this one, so might as well not stop yet. Why the fuck do you keep not playing any music, Sound Sense? Come on. Come on. It's like we need to reload it or something. I don't even know. It is now summer. S -s play? S do something. Hold on, I'll get this. I'll get this fixed. Ah, uh, there we go. Back to the music. With just a little bit of music, I mean. It it's just good to have it in the background. I think. I personally prefer it in the background a little bit. Also, uh, there is a cougar here. It is a solitary feline. Uh, also, obviously that means it's female, I assume. I know that's not what it means, but still, I, 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 I like I like fucking with people. Still, still, it seems like we still do have that ghostly miner. Um, I don't know who is going to build those walls, but we need somebody to do it eventually. It seems like somebody's actually actually is going up there to do it, which is good. That will cut off that'll cut off people from you know attacking us from up there. This is still filling up. That's actually surprising. I think I figured it would you know not take quite that long, but. I figured it was like come out in a rush and just like feel up immediately, but obviously that's not how it is. And they're still building that wall, which is good. Very good, very good. And official cleaner cancels dig seeking infant. God damn. Did he lose his kid already? Come on, guys. Come on, you can do better than that. It also seems like that ghost guy up there is just like sitting around. It's kind of creepy. Kind of really creepy, actually. Uh, but oh well. He's going to be a ghost until, uh, until we do get him. Mm, there's some Slab is on here somewhere. I mean, let's just get rid of that ghost guy real quick. I know we can. I just got to find Slab. There it is. And we'll set it Right here. Feldspar Slab. Very good. Very, very, very good. So that'll be able to get that out of the way. I am thinking about making a few more miners. Yeah, yeah, I know. I reloaded Dwarf Warrior. Come on, connect to it, read my drawers. Do any of them actually have any mining stuff? Obviously, that's not going to work unless I. Ghostly Miner has been put to rest. Thank God, and that's gonna stop. That's gonna stop him from bugging the people. I do want to make a few more miners, so let's actually go with the ones that have highest skill. These two are only dabbling. I will make these two miners. Are these two kids? No. But he's a master lasher. Don't know what the fuck that means, but it, does, it apparently doesn't have any effect on uh, it, him being a dwarf. Why the fuck is he? Is that a kid? It's gotta be. Whatever. Seeking input. All right. One of the reasons why I'm trying to add a few more and why are those tables red. Real gar. Okay, that's why they're red. Gotcha. The reason why I do want to add a few more is um, I do want to start digging out bedrooms. I also am going to need a lot more stone for that too. So I'm going to dig out kind of like a little path over here. And I'm I'm not 100% sure how I want to do bedrooms yet, but I kind of have an idea on how I want to do it. But I don't know how well it would work, um, especially since we do have that volcano over there. Hmm. 
there's going to be like a two hour time skip because I've done a lot of things and I did a lot of actual digging, not actual digging, but you know, digging plans. And uh, this is probably going to be the last episode for today now. Um, as far as building the bedrooms go and the stockpiles, which we both need and both things that we're going to need to do, I actually decided I would build or dig out or plan to dig out giant rooms like this so that we could have, um, you know, like each of these rooms individually will be a stockpile of some sort, like wood and one, weapons and stuff and another, you know, etc, etc. And we'll have it individualized like that. But as you can see from there, it will go down into the bedrooms. This is a fractal style bedroom. I am kind of partial to fractal styled things, always have been. And a lot of these bigger um, hallways will have statues and um, in some of these areas, kind of like this one right here, we will put um, like coffins and stuff to keep our people in better shape. And this room down here, I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with it. I might refit this to be a military training area or a fun area because I do know since we are in Genesis we do have access to stuff like chess tables and stuff like that but I'll refit that to something else because in these kind of oddly shaped rooms I will be putting um, up and down tables like uh, you know like right here will be a little thing of tables and up there you know up and down like that we will not be digging out all of this at once this would take a long time to dig out we will be digging it out as we need it which is why I haven't actually set it to be dug out just yet um, that being said, let us actually go and cancel the designations for this area. I don't want the stockpile stuff done yet. And the reason I have it going down like that is because I do plan on this level to fill it in with some workshops. And this stuff down here is going to pretty much only consist of the um, workshops that need magma to run. And on this floor we'll also have our iron stockpile, like our, our metal stockpile and stuff like that, stuff to be melted. Um, I do, I am very preference to these fractal style bedrooms, only because they're very space efficient. This is enough rooms to hold every single person that we could ever get, children included, nobles included. Um, nobles, I will just, you know, add together several rooms, you know, it'll just be like, like these four rooms, I'll just add together, just like, doop. Doop, doop, done. That'd be a room, and we'd go with that. It'd be good. And then we wouldn't have to worry about anything else for nobles, because I mean, we'd still have plenty of extra rooms. I am thinking about only doing maybe half of the... I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm only going to do like half of these at a time. Like I said, this is a lot of places, so I'm, I'm not going to do those side things just yet. Nor am I going to do this. And then I'll just cut it off right here as well. And we'll only have those bedrooms that are in these two areas right here. So it'll only be that much. If I cut this up, at least it will be that much. So that will get our miners something to do down there. So anyway, that, that will be pretty good for us. So I am going to let the miners do that eventually. I still do want to finish out digging out up here before we move on to that down there so that that's kind of the plan for now I, I mean obviously things might change I might decide that I don't want to do that but we'll see um, and if you want to know the name of that fractal style I'm pretty sure it's fuck if I know now that I think about it I think it's like um cuz I was looking up fractal patterns and stuff like that and I think it's like Raymond's Rainer, it's like Raynard's, uh, Raynard's tree or something like that. Mandelbord's tree! Mandelbord. There we go, that's what it is. Mandelbord's tree, so there you go if you wanted to know what it was. Also, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to need... Yeah, we'll dig out that as well. Anyway, so yeah, there we're going to be digging down like that. This will be the last episode today. for today. There are going to be six episodes going up for today, so I hope you guys enjoy that. I don't know how much digging I'm going to let go on between this and the next episode. Um, they did actually get that wall done sometime. Not the catch in the southern swamps! Yep, and there is a U out there. And a ram. Probably could go catch that, but I really don't feel it necessary to do so. At this point, anyway. So.
So there is that. Uh, also, one of the reasons why I chose this style is it fits really conveniently with my uh, my little ascending staircase and the volcano because I can just put it down a little bit and it just fits ever, ever so perfectly. But again, like I said, um, that's also going to be a lot of stone. Another reason why I'm doing that is we are going to need a lot of stone for the walls that we're going to make because I do like making walls. I mean, that is that is a generic path thing that he really really enjoys doing so we're going to have that to worry about among other things so well, not really worry about but you know that is what, what is going to happen also I'm going to remove that actual little activity zone and I'm gonna add another one right here and we'll set that to a garbage dump and I don't think I removed that one and I didn't remove that one. Okay, so there we go. So that will get them to start moving the stone. That will get some of the idlers to do that. Um, I, I think we're fine with the amount of bedrooms that we have right now. Simply because... I mean... We really don't need any more. And how are the drinks going? Let's actually zoom back in. We are getting more of those. We're doing fine on fish, plants, stuff like that. I'm actually going to cancel making the... Somebody already made the leather workshop. Never mind. Um, I was going to cancel that. Yeah, they also made the clothes shop. Damn! I was going to destroy one of those so that we could um, put down a mechanics shop so I can make a little thing. Well, I'll make a lever, basically, for... Uh, oh, I just removed the masonry thing. So how are they doing up here on digging? They're doing fine. There's that baby. They're doing good. Also, did I... I hid these. I didn't fucking... Dump them, my god, Pat, what's wrong with you? Dump the stone. God damn, how's that so hard? For a minute I thought that said he became a werewolf down there at the bottom, but obviously that's not the case. And we are only going to have one, two more um, levels to go before we are done with that. Cancels dump item, misplaced item, that's fine. So, uh, yeah, it looks like we are getting along very well. Everything seems to be working fairly well, and that is good. I think I do need to do that to make it even. Right? Yes, I do. I don't know why it wasn't like that. Uh, D, T, I do need to chop down the trees in here again since it is spring again. <clears throat> the trees are have started to regrow. So have the plants. It's, it's, it's always good to just know that we have this area in here to do whatever the fuck it is we want to do with. Which is good. I enjoy it. Anyway, so he's going to dig that out, which we kind of needed to do. And that might cause issues. We have struck Rilgar. Um, what the fuck is Rilgar? This, it's, this, this is Rilgar, right? Yeah. So that doesn't do anything for us in particular. Which, you know, it's, it's neither here nor there, but... We have actually gotten a fair bit of Galena, and we've talked about this in the past, what Galena is good for. It's good for silver and lead. If I remember, I don't want to pause it anymore. I've already paused more than I've wanted to in this um, video set, but it's good for silver and lead or something like that. Something equally useless as lead, so it doesn't matter what it is. It just the, We know it's useless to us. But anyway, so we do have real... Um, the Galena, which is going to give us silver, which we can use for hammers, so... Um, looking at the fact that a lot of the people around us aren't undead, but more living creatures, hammers are actually very, very good, because they give you the ability to crush more than, you know, slash. Against undead foes, slashing is actually a hell of a lot more useful than crushing, because you can cut off their limbs, you can get them down and whittled down really quickly, because crushing them doesn't really do anything, because they're undead and it doesn't matter. But as far as living opponents go, cutting is good, hammering is good, but because we have silver and, you know, silver hammers are just so heavy and just so effective at what they do, since we have it, we're gonna go with hammers. We we have the necessary stuff, so there's no reason for us not to do it. Also, that stone is apparently really heavy because they are all going real slow. No, and I want a, a, a channel, not a that. There we go. So, I might make another episode after this. I don't know, and I might send these episodes out tomorrow. I don't know, or a few of these today and a few tomorrow. I'm not sure, but anyway, 
I, I'm actually really in the mood for playing, so I mean, that's kind of wise. We got one, two more floors 